We interrupt our programming. This is a disclaimer. Important information will follow. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Snake Rocks. This video is a work of fiction. Names, characters, businesses, places, events and incidents are either the products of the author's imagination or used in a fictitious manner. Any resemblance to actual persons, establishments, or events is purely coincidental. The author is not responsible for any real emergency alert system activations resulting from this video. We will now return to our feature presentation. We interrupt our programming. This is a national emergency. Important instructions will follow. This is an emergency action notification. All broadcast stations and cable systems shall transmit this emergency action notification message. This station has interrupted its regular programming at the request of the White House to participate in the emergency alert system. During this emergency, most stations will remain on the air providing news and information to the public in assigned areas. This is KTVU. We will continue to serve the San Francisco Bay Area. If you are not in this local area, you should tune to stations providing news and information for your local area. You are listening to the emergency alert system serving the San Francisco Bay Area. Do not use your telephone. The telephone lines should be kept open for emergency use. The emergency alert system has been activated. The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. This is not a test. Six nuclear missiles have been launched from unknown locations and are on trajectories towards the United States. Due to the uncertain tracks of these missiles, all residents of the United States are advised to seek shelter immediately. If you know of a location that is designated as a fallout shelter, go there now. Otherwise, go as far underground as you can, away from any windows or doors. Take a hand crank or battery powered radio with you for updates and instructions. Once inside your shelter, put as much space between you and the outside world as possible by barricading all entrances with heavy objects such as tables, file cabinets, etc. Do not leave your shelter for at least 14 days, or until instructed to do so. The President will be speaking on all stations shortly. Stand by for this message. The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. This is not a test. Six nuclear missiles have been launched from unknown locations and are on trajectories towards the United States. Due to the uncertain tracks of these missiles, all residents of the United States are in line.
stand by for this message. The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. This is not a test. Six nuclear missiles have been launched from unknown locations and are on trajectories towards the United States. Due to the uncertain tracks of these missiles, all residents of the United States are advised to seek shelter immediately. If you know of a location that is designated as a fallout shelter, go there now. Otherwise, go as far underground as you can, away from any windows or doors. Take a hand crank or battery powered radio with you for updates and instructions. Once inside, Stand by for a message from the President of the United States. My fellow Americans, deep down, we have always feared the worst in these tumultuous times. We have survived many threats and attacks in the past, however, one of the biggest fears is being realized right now. Nuclear missiles have been launched and are currently heading for the United States. We don't yet know who will be affected, but one thing is certain, there will be many lives lost. However, this does not mean we should lose hope. By taking some basic actions, we can persevere and emerge victorious. In order to achieve this, we need to prepare for what is ahead. Right now, I strongly encourage you to take the following actions. Get to an underground shelter and protect yourself. Cover your head and brace for potential impact. Once this has passed, stay inside until an all-clear signal is given. Follow the instructions and guidelines given by emergency management. Also, stay off telephones. These lines should be kept open for emergency use. If you make an unnecessary phone call, you may be endangering someone who actually needs it. Most importantly, stay calm in this situation and respect your fellow man, as this is the only way we will survive. While we may be crippled by this attack, America will not be broken. You have just heard a message from the President of the United States. We are currently under attack and are preparing for a direct strike of nuclear missiles to the country. This is KQED and we will be providing news and information specifically for the San Francisco Bay Area. If you are not in this area, you should now tune to stations providing news and information for your area. For residents of the San Francisco Bay Area, here is some information for our area. As we know of at this time, no locations have been currently designated as safe fallout shelters. For this reason, the best plan of action is to go to your basement. You should place as many objects between you and the outside as possible. This includes file cabinets, bookshelves, walls, and desks. If you have time, board up windows. Stay inside until an all-clear signal is given. If you are taking shelter in your homes, unplug all the electric devices and turn off electricity and gas. Once in your fallout shelters, make sure you are using a television or radio that is running on batteries only. If a member of your family is currently at another location tonight, do not leave your homes to get them. They will be taking their own precautions at this time. It is highly unlikely that you will have enough time to get them. If you are currently on the road, and this is very important, get out of your vehicles and find a shelter now. Go to the lowest level of a sturdy structure. If you are in a high-rise building, get to the lowest floor. Do not use any elevators. If electricity goes out, you might get stuck. Use the stairs instead. Do not call 911 unless you have a real emergency. Leave it for someone who actually has a life-threatening emergency. More importantly, even if a missile does not strike near the area, the risk for fallout will exist. When the missile explodes, radioactive particles will rise into the air and can spread for hundreds of miles. This is the primary reason for creating these sheltered areas. A normal basement may not be enough protection from fallout. At any moment, the nuclear missiles could make impact. We don't know the exact locations that they will hit. But The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States government. Seven additional nuclear missiles have been launched, and there are now a total of 13 headed for the United States. 
At this time, it is expected that these missiles will strike at the following cities slash areas, Atlanta, Boston, Chicago, Dallas, Detroit, Los Angeles, New Orleans, New York City, San Antonio, Santa Fe, Seattle, and St. Louis. If you have not done so, seek out a fallout shelter or find a sturdy building and go to the lowest floor. If you do not live near these locations, stay in your shelter and brace for the possible effects of fallout. Stay tuned to this station for further updates. As you have just heard, it has now been confirmed that there are a total of 13 nuclear missiles headed for the United States, and one of them is heading for the city of Los Angeles. While San Francisco is in the clear from direct impact right now, the fallout risk still exists. Also, the tracks are not exact, the missile may land much closer than anticipated. Stay in your shelters until the all clear signal has been given. Here is some additional information for our area. Do not call 911 unless you have a real emergency. San Francisco Emergency Management is reporting major problems with the 911 system. In fact, unless you have an emergency, do not use any phone lines, whether they land or sell. For obvious reasons, do not try to go out in a vehicle. According to police, there are many abandoned vehicles along the roads. Driving is near impossible right now. If you are on the road, get inside a building right now. If you are in your shelters, make sure you are using radios or televisions running on batteries only. We will continue to provide local updates for as long as we can. If we go off of the air, this is a strong sign that you should get in your shelter immediately. Stay tuned to this station. For those of you just tuning in, or have not heard, a nuclear attack is taking place in the United States. 13 missiles are heading towards the country and one is expected to strike near the city of Los Angeles, which is only a few hundred miles away. Emergency management and the president have advised us all to get to an underground shelter now so that you are better protected from nuclear fallout. If we receive any additional reports on this situation, we will bring them to you immediately. It seems that this station is starting to lose power. We will stay on the air as long as we can.